you're welcome to this channel today we are doing a diy on apple cider vinegar we are making homemade apple cider vinegar from the scratch apple cider vinegar is very healthy for you and it's something that should be on everybody's diet it has a lot of health benefits if you are interested in learning how to make it from the scratch you want to stay with me to the end of this video you welcome back so we have a bowl we have a sugar a napkin and two red apple actually it's red apple no other type of apple is used for apple cider vinegar we have our teaspoon and we have our water the water we're using here is a liter of water to medium sized apple two medium sized apple okay so this apple is actually red apple like i said before red apple you can use the green one for apple cider vinegar so we are just going to start off by chopping the apples i did a video some time ago on five probiotic foods that can help improve your health and we talked about apple cider vinegar in that video I'm going to be dropping that video in the description box and uh, also on the screen at the end of this video please take out time to watch that video so you get some of the benefits of apple cider vinegar okay so we are just going to be chopping uh, our apple now this is the first apple we chop it into bits after we're done chopping the first apple we are going to do the same thing to the second apple and they will put everything into the bowl ensure that you follow this process accordingly so that for optimal results if you want more volume say you want two liters that means your apples have to be four the quantity of the sugar has to be times two you know, because um, for you to actually get optimal results okay So after chopping our apples and putting it into the bowl, we are going to sprinkle two teaspoons of granulated sugar into the on the apples into the bowl. Okay? All right. At this point we add our one liter of water into the mixture after pouring the water we are just going to stir to ensure that everything is properly mixed please if you are yet to subscribe to this channel please do so by clicking on that red subscribe icon in the description box if you are seeing this channel for the first time on this channel we talk about relationship and we talk about health everything that would help improve our health that's what we talk about on this channel and also what will help to progress our relationships so please click on that red subscribe button and join the family so after stirring the mixture properly we are going to cover now with our napkins you you have to ensure that you have stirred it properly then the sugar has melted okay then you cover now with your napkin and ensure that the covering is tight there's no air going in as you can see the, the napkin is coming out a bit from the bowl that's to ensure that it's tightly covered so now you set aside and leave for two weeks so after two weeks we our mixture this is our mixture we open it up and to see how far it has progressed in the fermentation process we open it up and stir it very well after stirring we get our napkin again and cover it then we close our lid and ensure that it's properly covered there that is tight we set aside again and leave for another two weeks two weeks later 
we open up our mixture to see what it looks like okay we are going to be seeing the difference between how it was looking in the first two weeks and how it is looking six weeks after we started this process okay so this is our mixture we are just going to take a look now on how it looks inside okay look at the mixture can you see how it's looking if you are here you perceive how it smells as well you know that a lot has happened between when you started the process and now i'm going to bring out a spoon now to turn it so that you can see how it's looking inside the, the apples are melted a great deal and you find out that inside of it is having some kind of cloth like um, texture so, so at this point we're just going to turn it very well again and cover it with another napkin and do the same process ensure that the lid is tight that it is properly covered and we are setting aside for another two weeks two weeks later that is our mixture at this point this is six weeks after we started this process if you can see clearly you can see the top of our mixture the top of the the, the fluid there has some kind of um, covering it has fermented a great deal and the smell the aroma coming from it is really strong okay so i'm just going to stay now that's it look at look at it look at it can you compare with when it was at four weeks and when it was at two weeks can you see the difference the apples have melted a great deal okay so right now we are going to just bring our mixture and get a sieve a sieve that has no holes very thin sieve you can also use a chiffon if you please okay so we are going to sieve our mixture now take out the apples that have melted and get the fluid out of it okay so after getting out all the fluid from the mixture i'm just going to get a spoon to press out all that is left in the apples that have melted i'm just going to press it out so that everything we get all the benefits from this uh, mixture so we are done now with this and now we are going to just um, bottle our apple cedar vinegar i hope that you actually gained a lot from watching this video today if you did please give us a like give this video a like I drop your comments in the comment section share the video with your loved ones and subscribe click on that red subscribe icon in the description box until my next one stay blessed stay fabulous and stay healthy